Good luck, everybody, in our box break happening right now. We're around here looking for some treasure, and we're going to find some in this break with some presidential signature or handwritten word. Here we go with our owner names. We're going to random the owner names seven times. We're going to random the presidents seven times and stack the list up side by side. And then we'll see who owes which presidents in the rip. Good luck. All right, here's a lucky number seven, and the first random's all done. All right, let's get to it. Here we go. Now it's time for the president's random. Looks like we're missing a G. There we go. Good luck, everyone. I hope we pull a president's signature. Here we go, seven times. We have, we're in the fourth box now. We've not had a president's signature. We've had some great hits, so some really interesting stuff coming out and, and words that presidents have handwritten. Lucky number seven. Thomas Jefferson for Robert. Who? George Washington, Daniel M. I hope we can hit a big one in here. We've had some cool things coming out, but I want to see a president's signature. I want to see a JFK signature for Matt or just something crazy good. Good luck, everybody. Let's get to it here. So the whole list isn't showing, but I, I want you to know I can cycle around and move this list around real easy. So let's go ahead and break this baby open and see what we got. The first hit coming out of the break is... This one looks like an oldie. The first one coming out of the break is a document handled by this president, Pierce. Franklin Pierce. Fourteenth president of the United States of America, Franklin Pierce, is owning the break. So... Let's see who's got Pierce. It's Christopher J. Congratulations, Christopher J. Franklin Pierce. This is your hit. So you can go and see the whole document 
right there on that website. But that is a part of the document that Pierce handled during his career. And now we have the bigger hit out of the box break. And we're hoping it's a big signature from a president. What is it going to be? Who's it going to be? It's an Eisenhower, everybody. It's a Dwight Eisenhower. It is a word. And it looks like the word phone to me. I, I mean, it's hard to distinguish the word right here. It looks like phone. Anybody else want to take a shot at what word that is? You'll be able to, t to know the word. If you, if you go look on the site, you'll be able to know the word. It's uh, Eisenhower, and it could be a, a word that's relevant, you know, to his, to describe him. I'm sure it's pretty cool for anybody to have a word written by Eisenhower. Who's got, that's Matt C. who hits in this thing. Congratulations, Matt. Yeah, it looks like phones to me. Yeah, that's what it looks like to me, too. Phones or phone. Could be plans. <laughs> uh, could be flames. Yeah, it could be the word flame. Which there was a lot of war during Eisenhower's administration. So the word flame would be pretty wild to have. Uh, but maybe, maybe someone could go look it up, you know, and figure out what word it is using it in the context. Maybe you've already done that. Either way. Uh, it's very interesting stuff coming out of this break. And congratulations to the two guys that come away really nicely. Matt C. with the Eisenhower, handwritten Eisenhower relic. And uh, the Pierce, uh, the one right there. Christopher J., congrats. Pretty cool stuff coming out of here.